gonna show the whole world what we're all about. We're the girls with the passion for passion. Ooh, we're rats. We'll always be there for each other. Ooh, we're rats. Yeah. Styling how we feel. Ooh, talking about our best friends. Yeah. Together we can do anything. We all gotta plan the dream. Take a chance and believe. Make it real. Yeah. Rats. I got all my stuff back. I mean, except my allowance. Guess I won't be shopping at the mall for a while. That's awful. <laughs> Man, no way would I have let that dude get away. I would have pounded his face into the ground. Hey, Yasmin just didn't let the guy get away. She was on it. Hi, everyone. I've got a special announcement to make. As your reigning school president, I'm declaring this Styles High's very first It's Not About Me week. Gag me. Go, Chloe! <laughs> <laughs> <coughs> hey! So, I want everyone to reach out to someone else and do something awesome to help them. Let's make a really rocking difference in the lives of others. Bring sunshine where there's rain, hope where there's despair, and styling platforms where there are icky old sneakers. So, guys, what do you think of my idea? Styling, scorching, jamming, hot. hot! I already know what I'm gonna do. Teach Yasmin karate so she can beat up muggers. Thanks. I'll pass. Deal, what do you know about karate anyway? Uh, excuse me? I've only seen about 50 Bruce Lee movies. Hi -ya! <laughs> Not cool. Rock, hey, you. how's it going? Uh, those are some stomach muscles you got there. Uh, you could be a, um... Linebacker or a wall? I'm gonna squash you like a bug. <laughs> oh, yeah. Come, come over here. Oh, man. I... Rock! He didn't mean to hit you. Stop! Oh, yeah? Who's gonna make me? Look, I'm warning you. You're warning me. Huh, what a joke. Out of play! <laughs> Whoa! Hey, I've seen every Bruce Lee movie, too. Rock, I'm sorry, but I did try to warn you. <laughs> Dylan, you are dead meat. As soon as I can walk again. So, I'm volunteering at K Nice Radio's Teen Hotline, and I start tonight. Cool. I'm doing double duty at my pet rescue group. Yeah? Well, you guys are lucky. I gotta teach the worst student in driver's ed to drive. Request of the principal. Ooh, that's so bites. So, what's your project, Cool Cat? No hairstyle and nothing. No toe ring and nothing. He still won't even look at me. What's wrong with me? I think I just found it. Roberta! Roberta! How can I get him to ask me out? Maybe if I got a new tattoo. I don't think so. Even if I made it a rat? Um, no. Hey, how about a makeover? You could be my project for It's Not About Me Week. Chloe, hey! Oh, pretty princess, you are so not going to believe who I have to work the teen hotline with. I can't believe I, like, have to do this lame job with you. Okay, girls, this is it. You know what to do. I'm like Kirsty. 
And I'm Chloe. Welcome to Teen Hotline. Let's hear from our very first caller. Hi. How can we help? I just found out my boyfriend's been cheating on me with my best friend. Oh, that's terrible. How could they do that to you? You must be so hurt and confused. Oh, the pain, the suffering. Oh, wah. Get me a violin. You deserve so, so much better. Move on and find someone else who's capable of being faithful and loving and kind. Or at least, like, throw a brick through his windshield. A guy who loves sunsets. Oh, and walks on the beach. Stop! You're making me puke. Um, sucker girl, like, here's what you do. Tell everyone that your best friend's got these, like, really gross underarms it, and then, like, spray paint boil butt all over her car. Yeah! She can't do that! Like, sure she can. It's easy. All she needs is a spray can. But that's so wrong! You've got to talk to your friend. Hi. How can I help you? I, like, really messed up my father's car, and I'm afraid to tell him. Ugh. Ditch the car across town and tell him it was stolen. That way, you can blame it on the car thief. Kirsty, are you crazy? If he lies about the car being stolen, he could go to jail. Give me the mic! Give me the mic! I'm not finished yet. Ah! Ah! Give, give, give me that old... Dead meat, man. When I get my hands on Dylan. Ugh! Ugh! Guys, this is bad. Real bad. Guess who my driving student is? Ah! Yeah, and then when I found out that you were gonna be my driving instructor, I said, no way! And he said, like, yes way. Casey, quit talking. Keep your eyes on the road. Watch out! <laughs> ah! uh, would you, like, calm down, okay? I know what I'm doing. I mean, like, you're worse than Kirsty telling me what to do. Stop! <laughs> you don't have to yell, you know. I can't, I like, hear you. you describe your style? Um, black leather, spikes, you know, kind of like the girl next door. Got it. Roberta, it's morphin' time. Raging. That guy I'm crushing on won't even talk to me, so do whatever you want. Turn me into a blonde fashion doll if you have to. <laughs> Yasmin, meet the new Roberta. <gasps> so, what do you think? Super styling. I look like you. Um, not quite. Now, are you ready to rock the world? Uh, uh. Or maybe after we go over a few things. Just say, look, ferret face, stuff it. You can't say that to your teacher. You'll get expelled, and then you'll never graduate or get a good job, and when you're 30, you will wonder where your life went. <sighs> Roberta, you gotta lose the gum. Okay, you're on a date. Guys love to talk about themselves, so start by asking him a question. Um, does food ever get stuck in your tongue, stud? Ew! Hi, my cat died today. Get a new one. Next! You didn't give me a chance to reply! We're supposed to be helping people. Cat girl, if you want to talk, call me on my cell at 555-0124. You are, like, such an idiot. Now all these losers are going to be, like, calling you in the middle of the night. 
Talk to me. I do not like being called a loser. You're not a loser. You're seeking advice to improve your life. So, like, what's your problem? Well, no one likes me. Loser! Loser, loser! Don't you dare hang up on him. Win it! You'll break it! Crybaby loser, loser! <laughs> you about keeping your eyes on the road? No radio, no talk. Just focus! You are, like, so bossy. Drive! This parking lot is, like, so boring. I want to go on the freeway. Oh, forget it. We're staying right here in this parking lot! <laughs> Dylan, man, when I find him. That is so sad. <laughs> then what happened? <laughs> Excuse me, Chloe, have you seen Dylan lately? <laughs> Relax, Dylan, it's only me. I, I knew that. You're not still hiding from Rock. Me? No way, not me. Um, hand me that menu. Enough already. How's about I teach you a little self-defense? You teach me? <laughs> yeah, right. So when can we start? not about me project. <laughs> it's great. Our audience is up 30%. <laughs> That's awesome. I know. It's really slamming. If only I could just stop thinking about those poor callers. <gasps> poor little Lisa. All the kids just keep teasing her about her mustache. <laughs> How about you? Well, I'm stoked about my project. I've turned a biker chick into... A biker chick? Roberta, what happened? You ruined my life, that's what happened. That dude I was crushing on said he hated the new me, and the only reason he didn't ask me out before was because he thought I was too hot for him. Now he says I'm too stylish and suck up like I'm so miserable. <laughs> I hate you! What was I thinking? How could I have been so wrong? Don't worry, cool cat. I am so here for you. You just sit down and tell me all about it. What if Rock attacks me? Ugh, oh, please! If Rock attacks from the front, fend him off with your feet. Watch. Now you try. Got it.
Since you are incapable of listening, I am going to show you how to drive. But I want to drive. No way! Never again! This car is my parents' prized possession. If I get one scratch on it, I'm dead. Dead. Get it? No more. Gone. So shut up! Don't say a word. Just sit there and don't move. I think you can manage that. Yeah. Oh, just let me at him. Dylan, I wish you'd just give up this whole idea of fighting Rock. Uh-oh. No way. I'm gonna make him wish he never crossed the deal, man. <laughs> Say your prayers, Dill man. so fast you want a piece of me too uh no man we're cool so where do you learn karate <laughs> dude i was born to kick butt hey jade roberta i'm so sorry i messed things up with that guy you like hey it's cool at least that freaky makeover got his attention he's decided i must be wacko so he asked me out slamming yo rock Express yourself, girlfriend. Pull over now, you hear me? Uh, you can't make me, you can't make me. <laughs> After all, he is your brother. Give him another chance. Fill his sneakers with rotten eggs. Like, what's your problem? Like, I've got this backseat driver, except that she's in the front seat, and she's like a total control freak. I mean, listen to what she's like saying to me right now. Stop talking on the phone! Pull over! Stop! Give me that! Watch out! <laughs> Give me the phone. See what I mean? Like, totally, Casey. <gasps> like, how did you know it was me? Well, if I were you, I'd tell Miss Bossy Pants to, like, walk already. You are going down. My, my, temper, temper. Oh, my gosh. Is that you, Bunny Boo? Oh, what so, as I was, like, saying... Pull over. Uh, uh... Your show made headlines. Auto accident unfolds on Teen Hotline Radio. Uh, not awesome. I'm banned from my parents' car for three months. Oh, Bunny Boo, that's terrible. Sit down and tell me all about it. Chloe! Chloe! Sorry, <laughs> force of habit. Okay, so Not About Me Week wasn't the best idea I had as school president, but at least we got a Scorching Magazine article out of it. 
Everybody.